Assalamualaikum. Apa khabar orang Malaysia? Alright, hari ni hari Ahad kita um, saya Syamsul daripada Loko. Uh, hari ni kita akan uh, berborak dengan yang berhormat uh, Datuk Seri Hajah Nancy bin Shukri, uh, Menteri Menteri Pelancongan Seni dan Budaya Malaysia. Kita nak borak santai-santai je hari ni. Kita nak tahu apa YB buat dekat rumah sepanjang tempoh MCO ni, KP, uh, P, uh, PKP. Uh, kita nak tahu juga um, bagaimana beliau uh, menjalani uh, hari-hari uh, sepanjang tempoh uh, PKP. Uh, dah tiga minggu kan. Uh, beliau mungkin sibuk dengan urusan beliau sebagai uh, ahli parlimen. Dan masa yang sama juga sibuk, uh, you know, uh, apa ni, uh, berurusan dengan uh, uh, keluarga dan kita nak tahu YB sekarang ni berada dekat mana adakah beliau sekarang ada dekat KL atau berada dekat Kuching so kita nak tahu, dan sekejap lagi kita akan berbual secara santai je dengan uh, YB so kalau um, korang ada uh, soalan atau ada apa-apa uh, pertanyaan nak tanya dengan YB jangan terlalu serius sangat, jadi kita berbual lebih kepada kita nak mengenal Uh, pribadi dan uh, uh, sus, uh, susuk uh, YB Nancy macam mana orang dia kan sebab saya pun uh, inilah kali kedua baru saya berborak dengan beliau so kita nak berborak lagi dan kita nak tahu uh, apakah perancangan beliau uh, sekarang uh, dan selepas uh, tempoh uh, PKP berakhir nanti So kalau korang ada soalan, kita sama-sama berborak dengan uh, YB Nancy sebentar lagi untuk kita um, share sedikit sebanyak tentang apakah perancangan semua orang di luar sana sama ada anda seorang traveller, anda seorang uh, pengusaha produk pelancongan, pengusaha makanan, pengusaha resort ataupun hotel, Airbnb, homestay dan seterusnya. So kita nak tahu uh, mungkin... Uh, YB boleh uh, mendengar keluhan ataupun permasalahan anda dan kita boleh share bersama-sama pada hari ini uh, mungkin YB boleh take note dan take down every uh, single um, uh, problems yang kita hadapi dan insya Allah kita sama-sama nak uh, nak ni nak bekerjasama lah untuk um, uh, membantu uh, menguruskan uh, Uh, industri pelancongan selepas habis tempoh MCO tapi sebenarnya bukan hanya selepas uh, kita tak kita tak akan tunggu selepas habis tempoh MCO ni kita juga kalau boleh kita nak buat sekarang uh, apa yang boleh kita buat secara uh, digital mana oh, sebab pada masa sekarang ni ada uh, digitalization adalah sangat penting bukan hanya um, tertumpu kepada salah satu uh, bidang saja, so macam-macam kita boleh buat dengan jenis kan. Ok, kejap lagi kita nak hubungi YB, saya rasa uh, producer kami dah bersedia untuk uh, kita hubungi YB untuk YB join kita bersama-sama dalam live pada hari ini Ok, kejap lagi, so uh, um, untuk orang ada soalan untuk ada orang sawak yang menonton hari itu, untuk orang ada soalan, boleh tanya dengan YB apa aja benda nak orang mau tanya berkaitan dengan apa aja, okay? Personal ataupun uh, uh, berkaitan dengan uh, tugas beliau sebagai menteri pelancongan. So nama kami Syamsul, kami daripada Loko. Loko merupakan sebuah uh, sebuh uh, kumpulan komuniti uh, yang kami orang pun objektif adalah untuk uh, evocate and showcase. Uh, Uh, culture, tourism, people, you know, you name it. So, hari itu uh, kami orang akan berborak lah berloya dengan YB. So, pada anda, sorry saya bercakap dalam bahasa Sarawak uh, uh, sikit sebab saya nampak ramai kawan-kawan dan orang-orang dari Sarawak yang join live kita pada hari ini. Uh, mungkin kita boleh contact YB, mungkin YB dah bersedia. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. Apa khabar? Alhamdulillah, Syamsul. Terima kasih. Uh, apa-apalah kita, Tik? Kami tu, Tik bersedia nunggu, nunggu kita nak ya kami. So, minum tadi main makan laksa Sarawak. Oh, wah, nyamannya. Untunglah okay. dapat makan laksa. 
Kebetulan saya marik pergi Farma pun makan. Okey. Um, dapat beli daun ketumbar so I can mulah laksa sawak itu lah. Ah, okey, okey, okey. Okay. First and lunch, brunch lah sekali. Wow, okey, 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 okey. Okay. Sambil Wabi dia tu macam, ah. macam pasal tourism. Ah, <laughs> so, okey. Ini tak macam tu? Okay, yes, 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 Wabi. Kami orang, um, okay, um, the... Thank you so much for uh, agreeing with us for today's session. Kami orang, basically, kami daripada loko. Uh, kita nak berkenalan lah sebenarnya dengan YB uh, dan kita nak ucapkan tanya atas pantikan sebagai Menteri Pancungan Seni dan Budaya Malaysia. Terima kasih. Okay, dan uh, kita tahu uh, selepas je pelantikan, kita pun terus uh, dilanda wabak uh, COVID-19. Ya, ya. Di, <laughs> tapi saya, kami, Alain Malaysia, sebenarnya memang pasti YB telah banyak pancangan yang telah disusun untuk uh, kita membantu uh, industri pancongan di Malaysia untuk memeriahkan lagi pancongan uh, di Malaysia di Malaysia. So mungkin persoalan pertama kita hari tu YB kita akan berborak secara santai saja YB ya. Samsul rasa kami uh, nak pindah tempat sejuk sikit. Boleh 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 boleh. Saya santai aja. Alright alright. Sebab santai so okay lah. Oh so at least dapat aja kami nangga oh, rumah okay. YB. Boleh lah. Oh okay okay okay. Empat kali cari ilham. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Empat kali ilham mikir apa mana nak dipola. Oh, ya, ya, ya. Ya, Alhamdulillah. Okay. Uh, terima kasih di atas peluang tu. I, actually, I want to congratulate kita orang kerana uh, dapat cari idea. This is a creative idea untuk kita dalam keadaan macam untuk kita nak apa nama kata orang, kita nak gunakan uh, peluang macam tu. Uh, mm-hmm. kita berinteraksi melalui online. So, ya, betul. Um, uh, kami rasa kita orang yang very kreatif uh, menggunakan peluang macam tu untuk uh, kita dapat ber, ber, ber kata orang komunikasi. Uh, orang dalam untuk kan enggak menganggap borak tapi mengesok pada peroya nak. Oh. Uh, so anyway, thank you very much lah. Ya, yeah, welcome and thank you very much YB for your time and you know um Uh, masa mungkin kami orang pun faham YB pun walaupun kita dalam keadaan MCO, KP, uh, PKP YB pun kami memang yakin kita pun, uh, YB pun sendiri busy minta maaf, minta maaf pada semua orang no, okay, semua okay. berkelakar Sarawak pula I oh, think yeah, to be fair yeah, to, yeah, to be fair to everybody, yeah. we will talk in bahasa and yeah, English, uh, kita campur-campur lah, mix lah kan yeah, yeah. Um, so uh, YB because um, mungkin kita nak start dengan, uh, nak bertanya dengan YB, sepanjang hmm. tempoh uh, tempo kita PKP ini apa antara aktiviti-aktiviti yang uh, YB sedang lakukan? Uh, aktiviti persendirian ke aktiviti? Uh, aktiviti persendirian as well as uh, aktiviti. Sebenarnya, ya, actually tugas. saya ambil peluang tu untuk uh, kata orang spring cleaning membersihkan dalam store lah ini. Dan <laughs> apa nama kata orang uh, enhance my cooking skills. Sebab so, jangan okay. anak. Betul-betul nak bermasak dah di rumah masa tu lah uh, Enhance uh, our my my cooking skills Kerana kita digalakkan untuk masak sendiri Makan rumah sendiri lebih-lebih Kata orang lebih uh, hygienic ha? yes. Untuk kita makan masak di rumah sendiri Jadi peluangnya I do my spring clean bonding I only have my daughter and my daughter-in-law ya Kami si boleh balik ke Sarawak Kita okay. tak boleh Sarawak takut kena quarantine And yes. then our Things is I must say that our meetings, especially as uh, cabinet ministers, yeah. Huh? Sebab so, yeah. pagi ada uh, MKN meeting untuk uh, membincangkan mengenai uh, COVID-19 tu. Mm-hmm. How to uh, uh, update, you know? So um, susah nak balik ke ke Sarawak. Sarawak, oh, yes, yes, yes. Kita perlu menjalankan tugas itu. Selain yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, tugas uh, rasmi dan juga tuan pribadi macam tu. I do my King as well. Oh, cool. So, but it's uh, not it's not di- that difficult. Uh, ke- uh, sekarang sebab kita ada banyak uh, apa orang kata uh, dunia digital di sini semakin memudahkan yeah, segala yeah, pergerakan. Yeah, uh. You know, you can face time with your daughters, with your families. Yeah, correct. You know, yeah, so yeah, tiada yeah, tiada yeah. tidak menjadi masalah. Show video apa makan hari tu. Saya <laughs> yeah, yeah, pun yeah. show video. I think this yeah, is a very good uh, apa nama way of 
to 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 reconnect to keep to keep um, in touch with the people yes 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 so things normally it's only with the family lah yeah yeah so yeah antara uh, sebab kita melakukan uh, ajak borak bersama YB pada hari ini adalah untuk kita mengenal lebih lanjut mengenai uh, YB sendiri so ada orang di luar sana kalau korang ada soalan atau dan berkaitan anything YB semalam dah bagi kita green light boleh tanya berkenaan dengan pribadi beliau eh sebenarnya YB Nancy ni sebenarnya salah seorang traveler juga tau kalau tidak silap saya YB kita pernah kami dengar uh, naik motosikal daripada motosikal besar daripada Sarawak daripada Sarawak sampai ke Sabah ya yeah, yeah, oh, Mas <laughs> Mas Ben is a big biker oh ok I'm pushing my day about to see but I follow my husband. Oh, you follow your husband. But so, not all the time lah. I, I don't see. Tapi, <laughs> sometimes you have to temankan. Uh, yeah. Sometimes when they are in a group, temankan my husband. Mm-hmm. Uh, with nah, the group, you know, so I follow. Um, jadi, yeah, it's nice to, to, apa nama, to enjoy the greens. Eh? Kita yes. hijauan daripada yeah. kuning pergi ke Sabah. Banyak yang hijau. And then kita tahu apa yang apa kembangan berlaku dari satu tempat ke satu tempat yang lain. Ya, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. So mungkin YB uh, boleh cerita sedikit berkenaan dengan apa uh, perancangan YB selepas uh, ataupun sekarang ni waktu MCO kita cerita pasal sekarang lah dulu YB. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Mungkin apakah uh, aktiviti-aktiviti uh, aktiviti aktiviti pelancongan atau ataupun aktiviti-aktiviti kesenian dan kebudayaan yang boleh kita lakukan untuk memeriahkan ataupun whether this is the best time for us to actually uh, focus more on our local uh, tourism tapi macam yeah. ni cara kita nak membuat aktiviti-aktiviti mm-hmm. macam ni mungkin YB ada cadangan atau mungkin ada berborak-borak dengan kawan-kawan ya yeah, actually saya banyak terima kasih lah dengan kawan-kawan yang banyak punya idea mm-hmm. uh, WhatsApp susah nak buka banyak gila message but anyway I am so thankful with friends yang banyak membantu punya idea of course yeah. I idea yang boleh kita gunakan uh, immediately bersama ada kena tunggu sebagai um, uh, seorang menteri yang tanggungjawab dan tourism kita tahu tourism is the the activity shape the country's uh, image kata orang kan jadi yeah. perlu memikir apa yang kita nak bawa ke, ke negara kita tetapi untuk masa tu um, saya actually I must, I must say that I'm so I'm so uh, kata orang very very uh, kata orang very hat very heartening to see orang kita terutama sekali orang yang uh, dalam sektor uh, sektor service sektor yeah. masih tak tu banyaknya yang menjual masak menjual makanan uh, the hotel industries the tourist tourist guides the the travel agents uh, yang affected tu tidak artis you know the entry yeah banyak affected. Jadi, how do we go about? Jadi, selalu saya fikir. Tapi, kita berfikir, kita bukan orang bisnes. Betul. So, I would like to welcome suggestions because we want to help you. Kita nak support industri. Tapi, right. mau supaya orang industri itu, saya industri players or the stakeholders yes. beri kita um, suggestion, you know, okay. like, to help themselves. Alright. So, you know, there are so many things that are coming up. Festival yeah. We have the Ramadan, we have the Raya, we have the apa nama lagi? We have the Tadau Kaamatan, we yeah. have Gawai, yeah. uh, and then of course other things yang boleh berlaku setakat ini. Now, yeah. how can we help you in order for us to save tourism in the country, to save the economy, of course to save Malaysia? Jadi, oh. yang perlu dilalui secara domestik dan uh, if I can say here, domestik tourism tu banyak yang belum dieksplor. True. Di negeri-negeri yang macam Sabah, Sarawak. Especially Sarawak, um, banyak negeri, uh, because dia besar. Yeah. I, I can share with you, I can just... Boleh, boleh, boleh. I just uh, promote uh, Batang Sadong lah, because okay. I... Okay. Yeah, I, sure, I see masalah. Batang Sadong, parliamentary uh, constituency. <coughs> I like to promote, because kami orang sih tahu apa yang ada di sini. Okay. Three state constituencies, ada Gedong, ada Simunjan, ada Sadung Jaya. Nah, what kan gedung tempat uang mula ada uh, apa nama keringkam ada kain sungkit nobody knows that not many people know that because um, these people they're just doing their part tapi sebenarnya saya ada promote 
So this is uh, one way of promoting local tourism. Okay. And yang exciting there. We have mi udang gumbi, the best I should say. The okay. Udang in the country maybe because uh, tak bukannya berjual mi udang aja. Hmm. They also sell that sayur-sayur um, just around their own house. This place, uh, tempat the mi udang gumbi to eat. They used to start with small, small kedai like biasa. Now it's going big. Mm. The big bikers would come, you know, weekly. But now they're losing the customers. Oh. And only that the kampung people who catch the prawns, sinela sidanya nak jual prawnnya lagi. So, so yeah. they yeah. big prawns. They used to get a lot. So orang pun toke mi udang kumpi. They don't have. He doesn't have to go around looking for prawns. We help the local people. So this is also our economy yang, yang affected by this. And this is Mujan, what do we have? We have quite a number of things, but the thing is that I want to explore here is uh, the, 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 the tourism, there is a tourism spot yang belum decapitalized. I went to one place, this is Mujan, dekat kampung Kepayang, Iban place. Okay. They showed to me waterfall yang si menah orang belum di ditahu oleh orang gila. Only okay. the because it it is in the private land. All right. Land ni si ada access road, tapi ni ada buah buah tempatan buah durian buah tu. I think this is one way kita nak promote lagi. And then okay. in also in Batang Sandung we have the longest river crossing bridge in Mel in Sarawak if not for in Malaysia, I think Malaysia pun sama river crossing. I'm not talking about sea crossing bridge. Okay. Right. Yes. Yep. So people don't know this, especially travel agents. We want them to know this because we yep. are like now trying to promote domestic tourism. And then we have the community Bugis yang they think very, very, uh, they, they, they outshine other, yeah, because the Malays are biasa kita dengar. Yeah, yeah, kita dah biasa dengar, yes, betul. Tapi the Bugis pun community, they, they have their own tradition. Rumah pun ada Architecture si dah nyempun. Okay. They have homestays that they can mm-hmm. promote their food. You know, uh, burasa nya lah. Many people yang bukan ada orang mungkin si tahu apa burasa. That's why. But these are the attractions yang yang nampak yang I I can share, which I believe macam the tourist guides and travel agents they they now have to learn to reroute. I'm just I'm just suggesting maybe they right. can. Right. Yeah. Because last selalu dengan BCT pergi jauh-jauh, right? yeah. they have to reroute where they want to focus for domestic tourism. This is about sikit aja, Amanda. Yeah, I think what YB trying to say is actually cuba, uh, dekat mana pun kita berada, kita cuba untuk melihat apa yang ada di sekeliling kita. Yes, YB is talking right. about her own uh, place. So mungkin yeah. kita daripada Tengganu contohnya. Cuba yes, kita Tengganu. waktu waktu sekarang. No, because kita ada orang tua-tua yang ada duduk dengan kita dekat rumah. Maybe this is the best time. Sebenarnya banyak hikmah ya YB yang yang sedang berlaku sekarang. Mungkin kita boleh bonding dengan family. Boleh bonding actually, dengan orang-orang yeah. tua. So mm-hmm. this is the time for us to actually dig more stories ataupun apakah pengalaman orang-orang tua dulu di kawasan tersebut. Mungkin mereka ada cerita-cerita yang menarik untuk dikongsikan. Sebab cerita-cerita ini juga merupakan salah satu bidang uh, tourism, betul tak? Yes, uh, story storytelling I call it. Yes, yes. Storytelling. So, Tapi ini bukan bercerita kosong lah. Ya, yeah, betul. Yang boleh menarik minat, okay, macam Tengganu, apa yang uh, culture ke, the food ke, the place ke, or even the toko. Why is this road called this? Because hmm. to, Tapi apakah, this is all... Uh, what we call local tourism tourism. product, yeah. Uh, and then talking about raya tadi, we call maybe we can have rebonding. Uh, rebonding mm-hmm. punya uh, uh, apa nama uh, raya because many all these white people are just too busy. Mungkin pergi ke tempat lain. But now kita gantikan supaya pergi ke tempat kita pun and then Betul. all the family. Cuma ingatkanlah we have to get guidance from the health ministry. Mm-hmm. Berapa banyak orang yang boleh kata orang berkumpul yeah. uh, nak um, masih lagi praktis kata orang uh, social distancing menjalankan oh. kita punya uh, penama uh, kita punya cara kita uh, bergaul ya ada jarak mm. ya ya perlu ada guidance tapi tourism must not um, end there okay. tourism must be alive all the time yeah. say, we save Malaysia through tourism. 
Ya. Webi, maybe kita um, ada beberapa soalan datang daripada penonton apa ni kawan-kawan kita dekat luar YB daripada yeah. Akasia. Uh, uh, VMY 2020 is cancelled. What is yeah. the highest priority for Motec for the upcoming years? Hmm. So actually, uh, even though we cancel VMY because it is not practical anymore, there's no point for us to talk about VMY 2020. Tapi as I said, uh, the promotion, tourism promotion, must not die off. It has to be an ongoing thing. Cuma what we want here is uh, what is it that the industry players and also stakeholders. Now, if we, uh, I, I stop there first. What is industry players here? Kita ada berjumpa dengan industry players, but I see their own their own heads of associations, the big. Right. But I believe there are more than that. Yes. Yang termasuk dalam industry players, maybe the stakeholders, even the buskers. You know, where do they come in? How how do they come in as industry players? I don't know which which part of the the, the heads of the industry players yeah. so they come in. So these people, a lot of them are very creative. How do they come and help us to help them? Kita bagi support and yes. we may have ideas, but our ideas may not be as practical as your ideas. Yeah. So the big thing for um, the coming um, events. Yeah. We we'll spend so much on industry players. Tell yeah. them. Of course, we have to see. We have to stand guided by the situation now, mm. especially uh, with this uh, COVID nineteen. Yeah. Kita, kita, um, kita. We have to be guided by the health punya uh, policy. Tetapi, uh, we cannot afford to get Malaysia to just be so solemn, be so ketawang, very uh, gloomy. You know. Yeah. We want to listen to voices. We want to listen to music. Yeah. How can we tap on the on digital digitalize? We want to go back to that. How do they come and help us? And how can they think uh, creatively? Okay, we have this product for you, and this one can also bring tourism uh, yes. uh, industry to 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 to, re, to revive in the tourism industry and to boost the economy. Tapi, yalah, we, we need industry players to tell us. Yeah, when you talk about in, industry players, YB, I think we need to expand the index, industry players punya list. You know, exactly. I think yeah. our industry players punya list currently is very limited to those limited. people yang, yeah. yang, uh, yang, apa ni, yang runs the resort, runs the travel agents, runs the yeah. public transportation, runs the, I know, buses. Mm-hmm. Tour guide. I think it has to also mm-hmm. extend it to photographers, for instance. Oh yeah, yeah. The local photographers in Malaysia are, you know, very talented. You know, I, uh, yang mana yang saya tahu sebenarnya ada beberapa orang uh, photographers di Malaysia ini mereka merupakan youth ambassadors. Contoh tadi yang tanya soalan, Akasia. Oh, yeah. Beliau yeah. antara sepuluh kalau tidak tidak saya YP antara sepuluh the first Canon youth ambassador in the world. Oh, bayangkan a, a world mm-hmm. brand, uh, uh, you know, uh, melantik orang Malaysia, 10 orang yeah, dan yeah. daripada mereka tu lebih. I'll take note of that. Ya, yeah, mm-hmm. 10, kata saya, 5 orang daripada mereka adalah from wanita. Dan, you oh, know, oh, we have yeah. to we have to make use of their, you know, nama lah, you know, untuk yeah, yeah, help us yeah. to promote more on the tourism industry. Okay, kita boleh uh, terus pada soalan kedua YB, ya. Eh? Yeah. Uh, is tourism ministry willing to be open to work with subject matters expertise, uh, for instance, commercial companies to get an in, inter, immediate campaign going? Do away with all the red tapes and have Zoom meeting with subject matters. I think this is what YB, uh, yang yeah. YB been talking just now. YB, maybe you can elaborate more on this. Yeah, the thing is, um, if possible, you know, we have. We have this online uh, kind of um, uh, platform. You can just uh, propose to us, okay? Propose to us what you can do, you know. And then uh, just for your information, not share yes. with so, okay. uh, I will be sitting down with my task force. Okay. I'm in this task force to make use of digitalization as part of our marketing strategy, our planning, and also to listen, to get, to, to get uh, feedback from the people to survey. But Back to this particular uh, commercialization is partner yeah. uh, uh, not, not promote um, you know tourism. Um, 
I don't mind. You just email to 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 us. You know. Yeah. Give us your proposal because we can't meet because of this uh, situation. But mm. at the same time, perhaps it's good for you also to show uh, yeah. uh, yang you can do through your proposals. Then we can we can uh, panama we can uh, assess uh, because we want to make more people uh, to come in and uh, participate. participate. Yeah. The, another thing that I would, uh, would like to see is where. Um, Uh, one, let's say you have a proposal, but okay. please bring in others, other stakeholders, so that they can also enjoy the benefits that we can give to them. Yeah. More people to uh, collaborate. To collaborate, so that they can they can earn their living. You know, I I'm yeah. worry is people sekarang ini uh, kebanyakannya they uh, yeah. they, they want food on their table. You must you must make sure not all of us come from a um, well-to-do family, and we all struggle. We have to uh, work hard uh, by thinking what we can do. Try, try. Kata orang ada yang kais pagi makan pagi, but we don't want to see that uh, happening in our country. Bella, sama we face this together. Let us solve this problem together. For yeah. us. This is what we want to see. So you are welcome to to give me your proposals, and I want to see that. Yeah. Okay, another question from Jennifer Ong. The hospitality and tourism industry players are all willing to help and work together with tourism ministry to inject ideas and implement the right step. I think this is a statement. Um, ada juga soalan sekali lagi daripada Akasia. Dia tanya, thank you so much YB for answering. Really appreciate it. A lot of industry players and local players really need help right now and they are all really to help. I mean, we work together. And the question is, has more tech set up an emergency uh, committee or platform to, to help tackle the COVID crisis for tourism and arts? I'm sure Rama is interested to contribute through proper channel. Um, that is solely on tourism and art. Actually, we are doing something overall. But now when you talk about tourism and art, I think uh, it would be good to uh, give us your online feedback, Nike. Starting tomorrow, I will I'll be because I, I'm in the meeting, yeah. my, um, committee, uh, I mean ministry meeting, uh, just basically to tackle this. So uh, we'll take note of that. So uh, we will get them to go online and feedback. Because you talk about um, what we are doing uh, for COVID-19, we have to help the right yard first. Dari awal, when, when things happen, what do we have to do? Yes. And I think you all now see that when use hotels uh, as currently. Yeah. So, yeah, very good idea. Of how we try to help the hotel industry, even though they are, I mean, of course, it is very minimal. Yes. It's, it's they are very minimal. But I would like to take this opportunity to thank uh, hotels, who, which are five-star hotels, you know, even though they've been charging high all this while, but they're willing to come in um, as uh, Katawang, just um, Katawang, their role to, uh, to, to help the nation. You yes, know? Uh, yeah. How the the DCS are yes. nation to to Panama uh, to face this uh, COVID nineteen break. So yeah. they allow us to use the hotels and uh, at a very low rate. It's more. Yeah. Okay. It's giving back to the community, can YB? Correct. That's right. Yeah, I, I just to want to thank them. them. Yeah. I just want to thank yeah. them because yeah. everybody suddenly mula mula ada hotel takut. <laughs> Some, I even received WhatsApp from hotel staff. Yeah. Uh, We go for this, you know. Nanti kita yang sakit kita ter. I say don't worry because you're not serving them. You're not facing them directly. They are serving the food. You left. You leave it outside the, the room. Correct. They're supposed to leave their room. So yeah. at least now we have more and more people. Actually, we have eleven over thousand rooms. Uh, yang yang participate, mm-hmm. but we have how many thousand as as as, as of today? It's about over five thousand rooms being being utilized already. Yeah. Okay. The hotel industry pun dapat kita tolong lah. I, yeah, I, yeah. Uh, We have to work together lah, Webby, kan? In this, yes. because the end of the day, you know, all this while, all these people, yang orang-orang biasa ni lah, yang yang support uh, the industry now, I think it's a, it's, 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 the, it's the way, macam kita memberi balik lah kepada yeah, yeah, community. Yeah. So, ada yeah, soalan so. Uh, lagi, Webby, daripada Khairul Aznan bertanya mengenai apakah perancangan YB Datuk tentang industri craft terutamanya batik. Um, ya yeah, batik hati kita perlu ni. Actually 
board pun belum belum uh, dilantik ya belum board uh, but um, of course batik is one thing that kita kena uh, put forward because we have a lot of students uh, it's yang buat batik industry uh, yes. small industry they cannot move on on their own with they need help right. yeah but, betul uh, even the bigger ones a lot of them cuma as i said lah uh, we want you to come forward how can we help you yes thinking uh, some some of them maybe ada ada ethnic punya design in your yeah. own uh, place don't just look at batik batik as fabric untuk baju maybe do yung yeah. kapa no then you can uh, promote malaysia through your design yes yes But one idea that i was thinking maybe you know i want to see people with more ideas yeah Uh, something that you know, if you use payung, for example, you use yeah. your design from your own uh, state, then yeah. uh, jangan terlalu banyak di- design yang uh, sehingga orang malu nak pakai. Betul. You get something that you can promote Malaysia, promote your, promote your own state. Payung ka, bag ka, you know, I can see yeah. it. Tapi uh, sometimes kita uh, duplicating, I mean, ataupun Uh, people got confused between Malaysia and Indonesia. Indonesia, correct. Yeah, we can because we have uh, we have almost similar culture and mm-hmm. these, those batik ataupun uh, craft tangan. Mm-hmm. We want to see more of them. I, I know uh, lately I've been uh, carrying a lot of this uh, local uh, Sarawak punya um, penan orang penan buat bag. You know, they add value to it. It's very nice. So it becomes a trend now. So what we want is. Malaysia to uh, to use our own batik punya uh, maybe baju batik is already been been uh, apa nama being worn on Thursday. Yes. But on other other occasions as well. Betul. We eh batik tapi kadang-kadang batik itu bukan our own batik. Yeah. State, state punya, I mean different country punya batik. So how do we use more of our batik to to be promoted so yeah. that orang kita dapat cari rezeki. I think mungkin when we talk about yeah, when we talk about batik for instance, this is one a very interesting subject to talk about. Ah, uh, say batik. Tadi YB cerita berkenaan dengan digitalization. So yeah. mungkin this is the best time for us everyone Malaysian, you know, mm-hmm. be it you are in KK, di Sabah, di you know, di Sarawak, di Kuching, mm-hmm. di Miri, you know, di Sentubong atau you di Kelantan, Kota Baru, di Pasir Emas atau di Terengganu, di Pakar ataupun di Kedah. So maybe this is the best time how we can do this digital digitalization punya uh, uh, thing is cuba share mungkin korang tahu yeah, utilize ha, synergize, yeah utilize this. Synergize, yeah. Synergize, synergize. Yeah. Share mm-hmm. everything on internet. Okay, let's say hari ni kita buat Mari kita kongsikan sama-sama batik Malaysia daripada daerah masing-masing. For instance, yeah, you, you, you're right. Yeah, yeah. that's domestic. Mm. Yes, and then we can expand that, expand this to food. You know, mm. maybe are talking about <laughs> nyabu makan uh, laksa sawak <laughs> <in> for <Brian. laughs> Maybe yeah. people in Terengganu will talk about nyabu nyabu laksa laksa uh, laksa Terengganu. Laksa Terengganu. Laksa Terengganu. Yeah. Okay, yeah. You know? yeah. Someone in Penang will talk about their own laksa versions. Yeah. And you know, is the list will go on, go on, and then Malaysian or people from around the world akan tahu oh Malaysian has a varieties of laksa. You know, maybe they think this is the yeah. things that we can do together. Yeah. You know, in terms of um, uh, 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 dunia digital sekarang ini. Mm-hmm. YB, kita ada lagi soalan daripada Carol Ongon yang nanya, YB nanti lepas habis MCO, ada tak program galakan promosi pelancongan seperti melalui kolaborasi bersama influencer atau YouTuber? Okay, uh, the first thing ya, yeah, the first thing first memang um, I have two yang akan dibuat tapi um, I would like people to come in. The first thing is I will be having key opinion leaders yang okay. ola macam town hall. We okay. want key opinion leaders yang boleh uh, berkongsi on how because they can share about international punya. Tapi tak bukan one in international, they are local people. Local, yeah. Successful business people. All right. With the internet uh, in, in with our uh, industrial um, uh, industry players. Yes. Uh, at the same time, I, I bear in mind what you have said. The industry players, we have to expand the group. I agree right. with you. Yeah, expand the group. Yeah. I think they need that opportunity. True. Second will be our interaction with industry players. And again, uh, I, I, I take note of what you said. We want to expand the group so that 
um, I can interact with them. Yes. Interact with them because they come from different backgrounds so that oh. they can tell us. Um, actually, it's interesting to listen to people with different ideas. You know, sometimes we like it, uh, we do not have the ideas that they have. Uh, yeah. And the government, we don't do business. We support oh. business. So, maybe you talk about uh, know your country, ka, know your state, ka, know your kampu, ka, yeah, yeah. but take from, from Trenggano, ka, yes. some, ka, whatever it is, you know. But yeah. how do they do it? Yeah. Because, um, we don't talk about post COVID 19, that one is yeah. not able to talk too soon. But yeah. MTO, we need to start our activities. We need to start kita nak tourism industry to rebound. Kita yes. nak pun ekonomi apa? Uh, they can pick up the economy. Kita nak yeah. we want to save people's um, kata orang peyok nasi. Let them earn something. Yeah. It's very worrying if we want to do it. Correct. Right. Right. We want to help them, but as I said, I want to repeat this. We want you to help us to support you. But how? Yeah. Please, you know, please come to us. Yeah. Now, I would be very happy to hear more. Of course, uh, those in the entertainment industry, the craft tangan, or all those. Everything stops now, and Malaysia is um, is kata orang very sunyi. Of course, it is the same thing with other countries, but yeah. we are concerned with um, you know, yeah, with with uh, Malaysia. You know, yeah. I have another thing that I was thinking of. Mind your language, tourism. Yes. People talking about kadang-kadang what it means in 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 Semenanjung may may have different different in Sabah Sarawak yes. So I think people can share that as yeah. a language tourism. I mean I'm just thinking as I yeah, said yeah, yeah. in this MCO I have been doing a lot of reading and also um, kata wang, um reading trying to make it realize but it's not for me to make it realize unless the people in the industry are willing to take it up. Okay. Mm-hmm. Alright, maybe maybe um, um, yang bertanya tadi mengenai dengan uh, engagement with the industry players, dia bertanya how, what platform will YB uh, be using for this, you know, opportunity for meet up? Maybe, mungkin YB boleh ada plan untuk buat uh, macam mana? Okay, if, if let's say kita masih tidak dapat berjumpa secara berkumpulan, okay? Yeah. We can use this kind of platform. Yeah. We online, we see, you know, we see. Yeah. I would love to meet up. I will go, I will I will call uh, industry players. Maybe what we can do, we will uh, put it online. But please register so that we know how many people are coming. So that we know how much food we are getting ready. And then we have to know the cut off numbers. Maybe mm. and divide the groups because maybe we are not allowed to gather with so many people. Yes. That people register. Uh, right. Is digitalization. Oh, yeah. uh, we'll bring it up tomorrow in my in my uh, committee team, uh, so that we know as well. Kalau kita prepare something special, food pun at least yeah. we, the enough numbers of food. Jangan yang complain. Oh, we we went there. Food pun si cukup. We don't yeah. want it. It is all uh, kata wang, um, around that. You know, we want how many. Uh, but please, uh, you know, just. Uh, register. We will have a platform for you to register, uh, and then uh, I just hope that we can meet up face to face. Yeah, inshallah, uh, Jennifer. Uh, Jennifer uh, maybe local as a local group, we will help uh, YB to you know to I mean, reaching out to everybody through our social media yeah. and oh, thank others. Thank you very much. Influencer juga. We will share amongst uh, you know influencer bloggers and media as well and local. Of course, we yes. will help the ministry. To disseminate the, uh, okay, maybe the platform yang akan maybe tentukan kemudian, maybe we'll have this. So just stay tuned with loko punya platform or other, uh, I mean, orang kata media yang sahih untuk YB uh, share what are the platforms that every industry players can reaching out to them. All right, uh, maybe thank you, can... thank you, Sam. Yeah, yeah, I think this is thank the best. You. you know, this is. As um, a pretty time for us to help each other, maybe. So, um, yeah, of course, Jennifer. Um, they tanya when can such platform engagement be implemented? Maybe I, I think they are eager to know. Maybe yeah, how excited. Soon. Yeah, excited. Um, I think everybody worry. Yeah. Worry, you know. Uh, maybe they not tahu. Yes. Maybe maybe boleh bagi sedikit. Uh, mm. Asal senang hati. Okay, actually, 
I, I said uh, just now, if MCO is still there, then perhaps the, the, the first thing that we can do is through VC. Uh? Yeah. Uh, see, maybe uh, I, I will have to talk to my people to make sure that I don't, I don't cancel it because of my meetings. You see, we have a lot of meetings these days, especially right. on um, stimulus package. And many, some, some of them, maybe they forgot to ask. Even though stimulus package has already been announced, we're going to have more because yeah. some people they are tinggal, tinggal from the the first stimulus package. We we have the, we have um, our roundtable session that day. Some yeah. of them uh, maybe they will be in this coming stimulus package. So we have quite a number of meetings. So I will have to see first when uh, when I can do it. You know, yeah. uh, maybe e even next week. I, I don't mind as yeah. as. Um, that one, if it is VC, but yeah. VCO is over. Uh, if we can do it face to face, I would love to do. It. Actually, it's all this, all this already in my plan in terms of date. I have not uh, finalized it because it all depends so much on uh, when we can get. Yeah. Let's get the boon. We have to check with uh, the Panama Health to find out how many people can gather. You know, and then so um, um, they have to register so that we know how many people are coming. Ya. Yeah. Okey YB, saya sangat kita ni YB. Mungkin kita boleh tanya, kita boleh tanya soalan-soalan ni lebih santai sikit. So YB yeah. tak adalah kita stres sangat eh. What is the best Akasia tanya, what is the the first makanan YB nak makan bila dah habis MCO ni? Oh, I really do actually. I really do my uh, terung asam dari Sarawak actually. Okey, what is terung asam YB? Sorry. What is terung asam for those asam orang dekat Terung asam ni, uh, terung Dayak some people call it. Okey. Uh, tapi if you don't masak, it, it won't masak. I see. Dia tak ada taste. You have to masak it. Masak you can masak either asam pedas. I like the asam pedas uh, with ikan, you know. Okay. Yeah, the chili or dwai, you know. Mm -hmm. That something that I really miss from here now because I cannot have it. Uh, and then mm -hmm. of course you can even make it into macam kerabu. Uh, mm -hmm. Maybe you kena bakar kan dia dulu. Okay. Then, but potong-potong-potong then buat kerabu. I'm not really great cook, but uh, these are things, especially this one, I really miss it. Or uh, maybe next session, maybe Moon maybe dah mungkin dah dapat uh, bekalan daripada Sarawak tu. Saya tahu dekat Bangi, maybe dia orang ada Borneo market. Yes, day. yes. But tapi no, because uh, of this COVID tinggi, I think yeah. uh, the market pun tak ada. So yeah. maybe one day, mungkin YB boleh share dengan kita online. You know, maybe maybe uh, how it looks like. How it looks like. So maybe maybe uh, YB boleh rakam and you know, you just upload on your Facebook. So uh, you I hope my sister punya terung asam di dekat taman. Oh, okay. Because uh, last time we used to and it's quite huge and then oh, right. grow here tapi uh, it depends kadang-kadang depends dengan the soil ka yeah on asam is what i miss actually yeah this is the thing that I think Asa, we need. I can do it here. <laughs> okay. I think this is the thing that we need to, uh, you know, explore more during this MCO, you know. Like, yeah. much everybody, like, from different, different states, different, different division dekat Malaysia, different, different kampung, we can share your own, you know, local yeah, yeah, yeah. delicacies mm -hmm. and, you know, local food. You know, this, this and then kind of you thing. network, actually. Yeah, you network, yeah. You do that. You network with each other. Yeah, yeah. I remember people last time through my my training network, they came over to Kuching and then, you know, that's how I network with more of them, many yeah. more of them I don't really know. Mm -hmm. you tell them about all this, the place where I used to go for my breakfast, pergi makan mikolo, it's a Chinese store, a Chinese right. uh, cafe, tapi um, most of the, the, the customers are Malays and Muslims. So they want to know what it is like, if I just brought them. <laughs> And then I even bought the the medin, asked these people to cook, and they they, they saw it is something that is um, not very common in many yeah. places, but it's quite common in Sarawak and Sabah. So uh, that's how we share. Actually, I don't really know these people. But yeah, I think as a traveler, can we be? I think this is what we what we yeah. always look for when we go travel. You know. Yes. Kita pergi tempat orang, basically this is the thing that we look, uh, yang kita biasa tengok apa orang tu makan, bahasa mm -hmm. apa yang dia bercakap, and then uh, dari mana dia orang datang, and the pakaian apa yang dia orang pakai, you know, this is the thing that sometimes mungkin lah orang-orang yang di luar, uh, luar bandar mungkin dia rasa macam, eh betul orang nak tengok ke makanan kita because you are having it every day. But the thing is, <laughs> this is the things yang we as a traveller, not tahu. You know, when yeah. when when you said all this, it triggers to me okay. that 
you can bring okay uh, this this uh, we have culinary kind of tourism maybe people okay show your panama share with them on how to masak midin how to yeah. I mean, using this as example because it's very close to my heart okay masak and then maybe mola umi kan you know what umai from sarawak how yes. do, how is sarawak food and then yes. you go kelantan maybe different yes and pinang you know how you cook the panama uh the petiao uh, yeah the petiao uh pinang punya ada petiao basah but mm-hmm. people feel that and wearing the the panama the traditional punya costume yes okay. very nice there's another tourism product yeah i maybe yeah. if i can share dekat situ jo i remember um many years ago i went to melaka So saya pergi satu perkampungan orang uh, uh, orang Chetty di Melaka. They have this uh, interesting dish called haram jada. Oh. <laughs> the, 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 the word is very um uh, yeah, tapi it turn out to be very interesting and simple food. Nya sebenarnya oh. macam sayur lodeh je sebenarnya tetapi that's a story behind it this is the things yang kenapa tiba-tiba nama uh, tu dipanggil begitu so it's quite interesting you know yeah if we can have this is what i told you it's good it's storytelling storytelling mm-hmm. yes and kenapa dipanggil laksa that, that the people it. share yeah betul betul and why it called yeah. nikolok yeah, for instance good. kan Aduh, yeah. uh, interesting. Maybe YB boleh share lagi apakah perancangan YB uh, untuk membantu industri players? No, uh, 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 as I said, no, uh, we want them to, to participate, but we want them to tell us. You know, through all these ideas, maybe because we, as I, I want to see them uh, doing what they have, they, they, they have been doing all the while. But how? If if MCO is still there, they have to capitalize on online. So maybe you know the special menu for online uh, for Ramadan special menu for for the for, uh, macam okay ini menu daripada apa uh, nama Melaka for example they mm. have online and then get the people I see that macam great food is getting very popular nowadays yeah. uh, but it's the normal thing that it is very restaurant uh, restaurant based okay based but it can have something that would apa uh, nama they affect Uh, the penama the industry through through the state punya ethnic uh, but please lah uh, share with us because as i mentioned to you uh, we are here to support we have to we are, we are here to support and then uh, we want to see uh, people to be able to move around and also macam tadi lah talking about tourist guides in the game tourist guides have to re strategize it's all about realigning and re strategizing what we want to do And for us, um, it's more about um, helping this to grow, and uh, we have to, um, like tomorrow after that meeting, they must move on online All right. to digitalize the information, uh, okay. um, so that the people will participate. And I know a lot of um, youngsters, especially, they are very online uh, savvy. Yes. They are the ones to be uh, involved. Is and we hope that you know they play guitar, kapa. But how do we help to pay you? Yeah. How do you create this to become a business right. during time? You know, uh, I saw um, RTM is using um, entertainment through online. Yes. The entertainers to sing online, but of course, even though they get paid uh, not as much as if they, you know, if you have the normal stage, but uh, entertainment. But at least they're doing something. So, yeah. can we do something? We use uh, whatever that comes under us: the seni, the budaya, uh, apart from the the apa nama the uh, all these uh, the places yang kita sebut tadi, you know. Yeah. You know, uh, we used to have what we call mukipah program last time, where people visit dari from one state to another. But okay. how do you create this mukipah through online? All right. Uh, if you cannot travel anyway, if you cannot travel, but travel online. Yes. So personalize your experience. We use um, experiential tourism, you know, uh, like yeah. telling daddy, you know, when you, when you listen to this experiential tourism. But it has to be a group of people who synergize it. How do you propose to us that 
becomes a business for you that we can make payments so that you can you can earn from that. All right. So I would like to hear that from the the industry. Mm. Okay. When, like yeah, ada soalan, ada soalan. Bila YB begitu uh, sebelum saya bertanya berapa soalan yang berkaitan dengan uh, pribadi YB sedikit. Uh, this is very fun games lah kita nak buat permainan tentang kita nak kenal lah dengan YB ni tak nak lah serius sangat kan. Uh, mm-hmm. Before that, maybe Loco can share something about digitalization. Uh, basically, when we talk about uh, online punya engagement, uh, Loco has been uh, doing this uh, every week. Kami, kami ada membuat uh, kelas joget kita whereby we have a professional uh, um, joget uh, teacher to teach everyone online how to uh, how to joget I and mean, joget secara asas dia we've been doing this for the last two weeks already and uh, interestingly YB uh, next week kita akan uh, ada juga satu lagi uh, kelas tapi ini kelas tarian orang kelabit daripada Sarawak daripada kumpulan komuniti uh, uh, a uh, iaitu Mupun Tao. So I hope YB can join us on this uh, uh, tarian orang orang ulu next week. Okay. okay, it will be uh, promote dekat uh, online across social media loko. Okay YB kita nak main game sikit YB boleh eh? Boleh boleh. Okay, jadi kita tak ada latent sangat. Saya akan tanya YB dua perkara, YB jawab salah satulah mana yang menjadi kesukaan YB lah. Uh, I think you love both of it but I think which one is the best atau yang YB lebih suka. Mi konok atau laksa Sarawak? Laksa. Nasi lemak atau nasi kerabu? Nasi lemak. Wayang kulit atau zikir barat? Zikir barat. K-pop, <laughs> K-pop atau irama Malaysia? Uh, irama Malaysia. Memasak atau spring cleaning? Well, of course, memasak. Hollywood atau Bollywood? I think now I, I choose Bollywood lah. It's more oh. thing. <laughs> okay, apa apa uh, Bollywood pun film yang Bobby ingat? No, because it reminds me of the old actors, the Rishi okay. Kapoor. What's your favourite? The old days, the kampung, we, we, we don't have TV. Yeah. Have TV, kita tengok wayang uh, yang Bollywood. Last time, we didn't, people didn't call it Bollywood yang wayang Hindustan. Oh, so, okay. the kampung watch in one... Wayang uh, pacar, eh? 50 cent. It's very nice. Cerita uh, okay. Bobby. Oh, so, Bobby. Okay. Any any particular actress or act- actor yang YB uh, suka? Oh, Rishi Kapoor. <laughs> very... <laughs> of course, now they're talking about uh, Shah Khan. Uh, yeah, Shah yeah, 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 yeah. Betul. Very, okay. very good uh, actor. But I still, uh, I still remind myself of uh, this this actor who was really during my time lah. Okay. The days. So, Rishi Kapoor is my favorite actor. Mm. Masih gila lah oh, dulu. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Beach holiday atau city holiday? City holiday. City not holiday. Person. Not okay. Not a beach person. Okay. Talking about uh, uh, tempat tempat untuk travel ni. Ada soalan daripada Saddam. Tanya tempat mana di Malaysia favorite YB untuk travel? Bukan dikata favorite, but this is something that is not easy for you to okay. go. Okay, alright. Uh, not Delhi. I've been there once, tapi belum dah explore betul-betul. Di mana? Di Lahad Datu, Sabah. Oh, okay. Danum Valley. It's not easy to go. It's, oh, Danum Valley, okay, yes, yes. If you are an adventurous person, go there. Beautiful, and then, uh, it's very much, um, you You are really hidden. Okay. Uh, hidden, no handphone, nothing. You can, no, no line, because you're supposed to be uh, name but I'm hiding from people. But second, I would like to um, also promote uh, Mulu Resort. Okay. People um, uh, tahu the excitement in Mulu Resort. Mm-hmm. Very nice. Tempat orang Mulu lah. Ha? Mulu Resort. Okay. Uh, I've been there three, four times. I still like going there night because I talk about the. I mean, I'm I'm, I'm more concerned about the exercise night at the. Uh, when I'm naik atas about 500 steps you mm-hmm. masuk dalam gua you know so I've been there and, and I still enjoy it so Mulu Resort and Denham Valley it's quite exciting so okay. I will mm, kalau ada peluang pergi lagi yeah. oh well mestilah nanti insyaAllah lepas habis semua ni dah settle kita mungkin kita uh, akan cuti-cuti Malaysia yes, maybe, yeah. Yeah. maybe Will be will you be launching any new campaign for tourism? I mean, for local tourism, like Chuti to Malaysia, or just continue? Actually, um, everything is in the pipeline, but we right. can 
Okay. Yeah, <laughs> paham, paham. Okay. Uh, yeah. Cuma, that's why now, in the seminar, we, we go for uh, webinar. Okay, seminar online. Mm. Uh, coming up, working together with MPC. Mm -hmm. uh, may not be there because of my other meetings, but my case will be there. Mm -hmm. We will um, be giving the keynote address, okay. which was about 1,000. 1,000 participants. But it's cool. Webinar. So um, this is where kita really practically uh, use this uh, um, online punya facilities. So that's where kita dapatkan uh, more more ideas from the people. So this oh. together with MPC. Yeah, yeah. Okay, what YB said about tadi di Sabah dan Sarawak ada soalan dia nak tanya juga. How about peninsula punya hotspot yang YB teringin nak pergi? Uh, uh, bu bukan teringin lah. I have been there, tapi oh, okay. lagi lah. I want to go to Melaka again. So okay. Exciting. Pergi dekat dia punya what do you call that? Um, apa nama tempat older? Uh, I don't. I can't remember what it is called. Tapi I've been there. Uh, rasanya we need to go again to explore Melaka more so that kita tahu um, the exciting part of Melaka that needs to be also to be promoted uh, and then uh, suka juga makan apa nama asam pedas even though it's more of uh, ketua uh, sahabat bernam tapi maka pun asam pedas pun nyaman juga kan <laughs> Okay, yeah. Okay, maybe mungkin uh, satu soalan terakhir sebelum kita uh, wrap up session hari ini. Uh, bagaimana YB melihat peranan bidang akademik dan research dalam membantu tourism di negara kita? Soalan daripada Cik Az Izamil. Actually, um, we need them to give their input because um, we cannot afford to have the same thing all the time. But what is it that they can contribute by? Providing us with new new ideas or new new things, you know, because they're coming with their research. But what is their research on that that can add value to our tourism? Actually, everybody in Malaysia. To me, I want to see everyone as um, our tourist, uh, our tourism ambassador. Uh, we want to involve the youngsters, uh, the researchers, or anyone who can contribute. You are the panama. The, the designer for Malaysia. To me, uh, those who are involved in helping us in tourism can help us to shape the country. Because everything is about how we carry out our duties, our, our programs in the country, so that uh, Malaysia will be a place where people can find varieties. People yes. can see like uh, the um, uh, apa nama uh, music punya ni rainforest festival for example uh, maybe the 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 lang apa nama the tarian apakah that can 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 pull people together but the research team can also look into a hey, what has been left out so this is um, bringing all parties together that's why when you talk about influencers this can also be our influencers yeah. we want help us to promote tourism but it's not just for for us, but it's for the country, for the nation. We want to save Malaysia, uh, as, as I mentioned to you. We want to save Malaysia from from uh, economic downturn, which is already happening now. Yeah. We want it to be rebuilt. We want to bring people back to get what they want on the table, you know, food on their table. And the young people, the youngsters who are very creative. I know they're very creative with a lot of things. Now we can see it on social media. Yeah. Uh, not just not just Malaysians, eh? yeah. the, to be fair, see globally. Yeah. Everybody is to be very creative during this time. Of course, some of them me, some of them are very, uh, very, um, uh, very informative. Some of them are very interesting for us yeah. to share. Uh, this is where I, I, I see that uh, from the bonding, how the children reacted to it, how the parents, you know, they start singing, they're dancing, you know. Yeah, playing games together. Is also, yeah. also contributing. So everybody, yeah. every one of us, we are tourism ambassador. Yeah. Tourism I mean, 
Ya, yeah, I mean if we can conclude apa yang YB nak cakap berkenaan dengan tadi researcher atau influencer, photographer and everything. This is the extended group yang kita akan masukkan di dalam industry players for the tourism industry players. So uh, YB will expand the invitation to everybody, to all Malaysians, you know, to be part of the tourism uh, industry uh, uh, so to work together to to boost up our industry. You tell people, please respond. And what we'll do, I will tell my, my team to say, okay, are you an influencer? Yeah. I'm, I'm a photographer. I'm an yeah. influencer. Yeah. I am a researcher. I'm an influencer. So yeah. that we can expand that because sometimes uh, we may not remember all. Yeah. You need to tell us how you can um, contribute. Right. And help them. In, uh, I, I hope, uh, you know, I hope to see people to to um, be able to carry on with their lives All right. as normal as possible, All right. earn their own living. You don't want to depend on the government alone. I'm sure we want to be creative. We want to earn our own living, you know, in yeah. our own way. So right. please, uh, you know, please just come forward. We are, we are yeah. helping you. Tourism right. is here. Motec will be helping you. Okay. Yeah. Thank Mungkin, you. Yeah, untuk, yeah, untuk Conclude the session hari ni YB mungkin ada kata-kata terakhir daripada YB kepada semua yang nanggar kita hari tu maybe we will have maybe 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 kita akan ada next session maybe somewhere yeah, next week or the following week yeah terakhir terus lah but this okay. is this moment yeah yeah okay maybe final say YB ya yeah, kita dalam uh, menghadapi uh, MCO ni sama-sama kita uh, ikutlah perintah huh? perintah MCO kerana ia akan membantu kita untuk memutuskan uh, penyebaran penyakit COVID-19 ini. Dan right. kita membuat uh, apa nama kita baik kepada itu. Kita juga uh, insya Allah kita dapat mempercepatkan uh, uh, MCO ini di 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 mutamatkan supaya kita dapat uh, carry on with our lives seperti. Itu. I wish you all the best. Stay safe. Stay at home and stay healthy. Thank you very much. Thank you YB. Thank you juga uh, daripada Loko. So uh, kita mengucapkan uh, ribuan terima kasih sekali lagi dan kita harap YB akan terus uh, berjuang di dapur dan mengemas-ngemas kat rumah. Sementara masih masih ada peluang kan YB kan? Nanti kalau dah dah settle semua YB, kita yakin YB akan sibuk dengan urusan-urusan uh, rasmi dan sebagainya. Uh, and then uh, thank you so much for the bottom of my heart and also for the rest of Loko Pun team uh, thank you sekali lagi and Assalamualaikum thank you, thank you to your team as well eh? thank you Assalamualaikum yeah, insyaAllah